Hello, Junior Drive. Thanks so much for tuning in and watching the video. That is definitely my favorite so-and-so show episode ever. They were hilarious, and you know I love the so-and-so show, so that was my favorite episode. And uh, so the end question is, when has someone forgiven you? Now, this is hard because I should be telling you about a time when I was forgiven, but then that means I have to tell you about a time when I was bad. So that's not my favorite thing, so I'm going to go way back to when I was little. I think I was six or seven, and uh, I was actually at church sitting next to my cousin, and she had the prettiest purse. And I was so jealous about this purse, but I was even more jealous about what was inside because inside she had bubble gum. And my family, we never had things like bubble gum. So I saw this bubble gum, and I was just like eyeing it up and really wanting to chew it. And so eventually I gave in when she was distracted and looking the other way. I grabbed a piece of her bubble gum. So then later on, she asked me, oh, did you take my bubble gum? And I was like, no, no, I didn't, which obviously was a lie. So went home from church that day and the whole week, I just felt so horrible and I couldn't tell anybody what I'd done because it was so bad. I'd stolen from someone. So I didn't want to confess what I had done. So, but by the end of the week, I just felt so bad. So that Sunday, I went up to my cousin. I said, Jane, I am so sorry. I really did take your bubble gum and I'm really, really, really sorry. And she forgave me, which was so kind of her. And she just said, you could have asked and I would have given it. So anyways, I know that forgiving is difficult, but I want you to think about a time when you were forgiven, just like a time when I was forgiven. And uh, as you go out throughout the week, I really want you to remember your memory verse. And I really want you to take this to heart because Colossians chapter 3 verse, verse, verse 13 says, put up with one another. Forgive one another if you are holding something against someone. Forgive just as the Lord forgave you. And I know you'll be spending a lot of time together with your families, your brothers, your sisters. So this is going to be something that will be really important to make sure you focus on. Forgive them when they annoy you and just move on. And also don't hesitate to ask them for forgiveness because there are going to be times when you annoy your family. And so I'm just going to close in a word of prayer with you guys. God, I just thank you so much for each one of the kids that tuned in today and for those that can't be here. And uh, Lord, I just pray that you would help them to love one another. I pray that you would help them to see times when they are maybe not forgiving someone that they need to. And I pray, God, that you would help them to remember that even though it's hard to tell someone you, when you've done something wrong, that asking for forgiveness will, is so much better than the feeling the guilt. And so just be with the kids, help them to have a great week and to study their Bible and to work on the things that they can work on and to be supportive of their family. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Have a good week.